Brandon, what were you seeing different about Means uh, after that, that rough start? I thought he settled in nicely after the second inning. But uh, early on for me, the, he hung a change up to France and didn't really have his best breaking balls early, but kept us in the game and put up some zeros after that. Uh, a little more aggressive in the strikes and locating better after the first couple innings. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you gave up three runs into the pitched into the sixth, and uh, we just didn't score. Nathan Ruiz, go ahead. Brandon, given how those balls were hit there in the bottom of the eighth, just how disappointing an ending is that? Yeah, you know, we've in in uh, certain spots here in the last few days, we're hitting some balls on the nose and getting unlucky. In the last series with uh, Sevi off the bench, line out, I would have extended the lead and then Trey down the line. Um, and then tonight, you know, we hit three balls on the nose in the eighth inning, line out, fly ball in the deepest part of the park, cut against the wall, and then and then Santander hit that ball hard too up the middle. So um, I thought we took really good at bats late in the game, but the first five innings, we let Sheffield off the hook and um, just didn't put enough good ABs together first five innings, but I was, I was pleased with how we swung about the last couple of innings. Todd Karpovich, go ahead. Hey, Brandon, that guy, Justin Sheffield, what did he do effectively to kind of keep you guys off balance early? He eventually well, he was, got to him later. Yeah, he was throwing a lot of balls down in the strike zone, down below the strike zone, a lot of sliders to our right-handers that, you know, we just weren't pushing them up. We were swinging at them and hitting weak ground balls early in the count. His pitch count was way down because of it. And, nor plan against him was to we need to see the ball up, need to see him up out over the plate. And he just kept feeding the sliders down that we, um, you know, especially early in the count, just a lot of weak, weak outs. So we got to do a better job uh, with our approach standpoint uh, up and down the order, uh, you know, to make it a little bit easier on ourselves. Joe Treza, go ahead. Brandon, were those kind of more the type of at-bats that you want to see from Mountcastle, especially late, and and even the flyout? Yeah, two good ABs there. I was really happy with that. So I thought he swung the bat good uh, those last couple of bats.